This morning, Western New York reeling from the deadliest blizzard in at least 50 years. This blizzard is the one for the ages. Certainly it is the blizzard of the century. More than a dozen people have been found dead outside in the cold. Officials expect that death toll will rise once first responders can reach all neighborhoods. They've already rescued more than 500 people while battling hurricane force winds and seven foot snow drifts in the streets. At one point, nearly every fire truck in Buffalo was stuck. And now we're hearing the good in all this, how Good Samaritan stepped in to help their neighbors. I heard him screaming for help. Shakira Autry pleaded for help on Facebook after finding a man screaming in pain outside her home. Autry brought the man who was suffering from severe frostbite into her home, but she couldn't get through to 911 or the National Guard. I can't do no more. I just can't have this man uh, uh, lose his life in my house. I have did everything that I can do. This man needs help. Finally, Good Samaritans heard her call, rushing to her home. Stretcher, stretcher. And carrying the man to the hospital. Then there's Shahida Muhammad, who lost electricity over the weekend. She was desperate to keep her one-year-old baby alive after his ventilator stopped. Local officials say they responded to the home, but didn't find anyone there. I was sitting there literally crying, wishing someone would just knock on my door, literally. And you know, if they said they knocked and no one was there, if they knew a mother and father and child were in there, they should have broke the door down. We were in there. We needed help. Muhammad and her husband say they manually administered breaths to their baby for two days until Good Samaritans came to their rescue. And more good news, Shahida says her baby is doing well, but thousands are still without power. Many roads are still impassable, and the airport is closed until tomorrow. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel, and don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.